Let's take a trip to examine this common basis of life, a voyage to investigate the molecular machinery in the heart of life on Earth. All life is related, and it enables us to construct with confidence the complex tree that represents the history of life. Our planet, the Earth, is, as far as we know, unique in the universe. It contains life. Here, plants and animals proliferate in such numbers that we still have not even made all the different species. Darwin's great insight revolutionized the way in which we see the world. We now understand why there are so many different species. Every cell is a triumph of natural selection, and we're made of trillions of cells. And in us is a little universe. Those are some of the things that molecules do. Given four billion years of evolution, we are each of us a multitude. Now, how did the molecules of life arise? It began in the sea some 3,000 million years ago. Complex chemical molecules began to clump together. These were the seeds from which the tree of life developed. They were able to split, replicating themselves as bacteria. The secrets of evolution are time and death. There's an unbroken thread that stretches from those first cells to us. The secrets of evolution are time and death. There's an unbroken thread that stretches from those first cells to us. Every cell is a triumph of natural selection, and we're made of trillions of cells. And in us is a little universe. Those are some of the things that molecules do. Given four billion years of evolution, we are each of us. It isn't the sharp line dividing you from the rest of the animal kingdom. It's a very wuzzy line. It's a very wuzzy line and it's getting wuzzier all the time. We find animals doing things that we, in our arrogance, used to think was just human. It's a very wuzzy line, and it's getting wuzzier all the time. Every cell is a triumph of natural selection, and we're made of trillions of cells. And in us is a little universe. Those are some of the things that molecules do. Given four billion years of evolution, we are each of us a multitude. Every cell is a triumph of natural selection, and we're made of trillions of cells. In us is a little universe. Our planet, the Earth, is, as far as we know, unique in the universe. It contains life. Its continued survival now rests in our hands.